So I need to check this catalytic converter to see if it failed or not. So I thought I'd make a video on it. And there's a real quick way you could check to see if the catalytic converter is working or not. And basically the temperature should be hotter coming out at the outlet than going in. And it should be hotter by at least 50 degrees at the outlet than the inlet. And so if it's not, then you know there's some kind of issue going on and the catalytic converter might have failed. And so to do this, you use a low cost infrared temperature gun. These are less than $20. I think I got this for like 17 on Amazon, I think. I'll put a link down below if you need one. But basically what we're gonna do, we're gonna let the vehicle warm up for at least 15, probably 20 minutes. Let the catalytic converter get real hot. And then I'm gonna check the temperature at the inlet and the outlet. And hopefully at the outlet, it's running hotter by at least 50, but hopefully like 80, 100 degrees hotter at the outlet. So I'll be right back. Okay, so I'm back and I let it warm up for at least 15, 20 minutes. So I'm gonna go ahead and measure right at that inlet just see how hot it is and so it looks like it's ranging right around 300 305 right around there right out that air inlet and so i'm going to come back and i'm going to check it right at the outlet and that is right around 357 almost 358 so yeah it's at least 50 degrees hotter than it is at that inlet so while I would like to see it more than that, it is hotter, so it is doing what it's supposed to be doing. So I would say that it's working and it is functioning right. So that's just a quick test that you could do to see if the catalytic converter is working or not or doing what it's supposed to be doing. It should be hotter at that outlet than at the inlet. If it's not, then there's an issue and you have to figure it out. The catalytic converter might have failed or there might be something else going on. You have to do more tests to find out for sure. But that's just a real quick test to see if that catalytic converter is doing what it's supposed to be doing or not. So that's basically it. If you have anything to add, please comment down below. If you have any questions, ask me and I'll try to answer them. If this video helps you, please click like, please click subscribe and have a good day.